Hello, how to solve for s and y in this equation? s plus y is equal to 28, sy is equal to 180. Solution. Then here, s plus y is equal to 28. Let us call this equation 1. sy is equal to 180. Let us call this equation 2. Then from equation 1, S is equal to 1. Hello, how to solve for S and Y in this equation? S plus Y is equal to 28. SY is equal to 180. Solution. From here, we can see that S plus Y is equal to 28. This is equation 1. And SY is equal to 180. This is equation 2. Then from equation 1, S plus Y is equal to 28. Y is equal to 28 minus S. You may also make S the subject of the formula. Let's call this equation 3. Then from equation 2, SY is equal to 180. Then S bracket Y is 28 minus S is equal to 180. Let's open the bracket. S multiplied by 28. This is 28S minus S multiplied by X. S square is equal to 180. Then we have 28x minus s square minus 180 is equal to 0. Let's divide all through by minus 1. This is minus 28x plus s square plus 180 is equal to 0. Now, let us put this in standard form. We have s square minus 28s plus 180 is equal to 0. This is a quadratic equation. Let's solve this using quadratic general formula. s is equal to minus b plus or minus square root of b square minus 4ac over 2a. And from this equation, a is equal to 1, b is equal to minus 28, c is equal to 180. Then this is s is equal to minus bracket minus 28 plus or minus square root of minus 28 square minus 4 multiplied by 1 multiplied by 180 over 2 multiplied by 1 S is equal to 28 plus or minus square root of minus 28 square. That is 784. Then minus 4 multiplied by 1 multiplied by 180. That is 720 over 2 multiplied by 1, 2. S is equal to 28 plus or minus square root of 784 minus 720. That is 64 over 2. S is equal to 28 plus or minus square root of 64 is 8 over 2. Therefore, S1 is equal to 
28 plus 8 over 2 and the S2 is equal to 28 minus 8 over 2. S1 is equal to 28 plus 8 over 2, that is 36 over 2, then 2 here 1, 2 here 18. Then S2 is equal to 28 minus 8, that is 20 over 2, 2 here 1, 2 here 10. Therefore, S1 is equal to 18. And then S2 is equal to 10. You got it, the value of S1 and S2. Let's solve for B1 and B2. To solve for B from equation 3, B is equal to 28 minus X. B1 is equal to 28 minus S1 is 18. B1 is equal to 28 minus 18, that is 10. Also, B2 is equal to 28 minus S2. B2 is equal to 28 minus s2 is 10 b2 is equal to 18 therefore our final answer are s1 comma y1 is equal to 18 comma 10 then s2 comma y2 is equal to 10 comma 18. You can see that the value of S1 here is equal to the value of Y2 here and the value of Y1 here is equal to the value of S2 here. I hope you enjoyed the video. Thank you for watching. Please don't forget to like, share, comment and subscribe to my channel. Bye.